there friends Debbie here from Southern Delight well I've just ordered this swimming pool it happens to be 63 inches in diameter and 12 inches high it's called a pet swimming pool or it may be labeled as a kitty pool also I think well I purchased mine from Walmart and it was labeled as a kitty pool when I received it it was called a pet pool <laughs> But um, you can get these pretty reasonable. And then, of course, you can get larger sizes. I happen to be about almost 5'5", five five, and this is a little small if I put my float in there. But it's great for a kiddie pool or a pet pool or for just something to kind of sit by and put your feet in. I can actually put my float in it, and um, it will fit my float, and I can get in it and lay in it. But um, I'm thinking I may even go one size up eventually, probably next summer. I may, when I change it out, I think there's one that's probably 71 inches in diameter. Um, the 12 inches, I bought these little concrete pavers, and they're 4 inches high, so I did them 3 deep. Um, Home Depot was doing a great sale on these, and I purchased... 58 of these to go all the way around it and then I stacked it like you would a fire pit real simply assembly real easy to assemble I'm not going to have to worry too much about getting chlorine tablets or having a filter on it it has a little valve right there that you can just screw in and unscrew all I have to do is just move the brick and then let the water out when I'm not using it pull it out it's collapsible and folds up great it's a real quick and easy DIY especially if you're just needing a place to kind of lay out and get some sun if your pet needs a little play pool or if you have little small children probably two and up it's really great for them but I um, just wanted to share this DIY I thought you would enjoy it and then in the winter this is what's so cool about it fold it up and it becomes a fire pit just throw you some wood in there and have a bonfire but it's very versatile and it works great for backyard barbecues but as you can see it fits my little pool perfectly and then my feet will hang a little bit right there but they do have one size up that's like a 71 inch um, you can also probably find some smaller pools that are a little bit larger in diameter um, so you might want to go 71 inches and above in diameter. It's like I said, this one's 63. But it works perfect for me. It's just one of those one-man pools. Or if I have little toddlers, we can have a blast in it. Kind of like the size of a hot tub. And this is the pool. It's just a little collapsible swimming pool. You just want to lay it out. Just stretch it out. It was really easy to stretch out. And then you're going to get your bricks and then start laying them around it. Okay, and just take your bricks and then go all the way around. I have gotten 58 of these little bricks. And I'm going to do a staggering. I'm going to lay them, go all the way around it. And then I'm going to come back on my second layer. When I do my second layer, I'm going to lay it right here in the center around it and make it look like a fire pit. But that's the pattern there. And just keep going all the way around it and I'm going to stack it three high. And this is what it will look like once you get all of the bricks laid around it. There's my Ellie. <laughs> She's trying to escape. She likes the water a little bit. We'll have to get in there with our float. <laughs> 